this is my first review on YouTube and I thought I'd introduce you to the new Marlowe Coniston. This is the Vulcan version of the Coniston. It's uh, just been released by the Marlowe Watch Company based in Henley-on-Thames and it's the only watch that I've really felt that I wanted to do a review on. Why? Well, because it's stunning. Let me talk you through it. It's a manual wound, a hand wound movement by Myota. It's the 8N33 movement. Beautifully smooth, very accurate, very reliable. What Marlow have done here is created a 40 millimeter watch, more of a field watch, which has taken some of the best bits from the Marlow range, most noticeably the Marlow Sherwell with the centre dial and the applied indices. Beautiful looking watch. It's uh, 40 millimetres in diameter, as I mentioned, 10.6 millimetres deep with beautifully angled lugs, stunning stainless steel case and a beautiful onion crown, which if you can see it there is uh, beautifully shaped, feels great to uh, to turn the case itself sits beautifully it's quite deep but it allows for the internal bezel which drops away nicely then where you can see it there with the minute markers around the track the hands are more of the shape of a the cross members of a wing of an aeroplane beautiful Beautiful with the uh, BGW9 loom in the hands and also around the outside of the dial. Beautiful. In the night time, this really lights up and creates a fantastic loom effect. It's uh, set on a nice grey, RAF grey style strap, which is beautifully leather. Um, again, Marlow Watch Company leather strap. Now let's have a look while I've got it turned around this way at the back of the watch. Again, with Marlowe, they love their case backs. This is an exhibition case back which shows beautifully the uh, Myota movement. Around the outside of the case, it's uh, got a quote from Donald Campbell which says, Courage is not being fearless. Part of a quote that he made after being, uh, or before going into one of his uh, um, sessions on Coniston Water before he tragically died. Um, it's the Marlow Watch Company from Great Britain, designed in Great Britain. This model is actually made, I believe, in Japan. Um, beautifully made, absolutely beautifully flawless make on this watch. Uh, I really do love it. It's got a lovely open case back, which really shows the movement beautifully. The lugs being so beautifully angled on this one, I mean, it sits very, very nicely on the wrist very nicely and actually doesn't feel like a 40 millimeter watch um, but it's stunning and in all light it's gorgeous looking at the case here again I'll see if I can just move it slightly to see but you've got a, a blue AR coating on it anti-reflective coating which uh, you can't really catch it in this light but uh, it really sets it off nicely the uh, sapphire crystal Glass is beautiful, absolutely beautiful. And again, as with all Marlowe watches, the execution is flawless. The dial itself, stunning to look at, easy to read, very easy to read in daylight or nighttime. It's a great, great looking watch, a great feeling watch. The buckle has a little Marlowe logo on it uh, with the, the M uh, sitting at the top. You can't really see it on this one that well. Um, there you go. I'm lucky enough to have this uh, Marlowe Sherwell. Uh, sorry, the Marlowe Coniston. I also have the Sherwell, but the Marlowe Coniston is a first edition, and I'm lucky enough to have number 0001 of 1000, and I consider that to be an absolute pleasure. This is a watch that I'll be keeping. I'll be handing it down, hopefully, in generations to come. It's very, very solid, very well built and priced at only £299. I think it's an absolute steal, and uh, I would recommend it. Go onto the website and check it out, Marlow 
mallowatch.co.uk, I believe it is, Muller Watch Company. Uh, check out, they've got a fantastic range right the way through from the Sherwell at 249 through to the Derwent range at 269, the Conistons at 299, and the Haskell, which is their Swiss made um a swiss movement watch which is sitting at about 749 at the moment check them out i think it's an absolutely beautiful watch um i hope you enjoyed looking at this and thank you for taking the time